All right, this Hyundai felt a small check. Monitors cannot set, been in many different shops, nor sent to me. Art class. Okay, we'll be looking here at the O2 sensor monitor. Sorry, O2 sensors, make sure they're working. I was too lazy going into the car and back pro for lab school, so I grabbed it. Bank 1 sensor 1, bank 1 sensor 2, I'm sorry, bank 2 sensor 1. On this scan tool, grabbed it, and they look perfect. They look fine. Now we're going to start a drive cycle. We checked some other things prior to this, but I forgot to record it. I lost the recording. I don't know what happened. But now we're going to check the drive cycle. We're going to start the drive cycle. What you have in his hand is some paper and the procedure that I wrote down for him. Now, people get the drive cycle confused with just driving the car on the freeway. It's different. There's certain procedures you have to do before the monitors will run. They call the neighbor criteria. You just can't like, drive the car. If you drive the car and the monitor still doesn't run, there's something that's wrong. Either something is not working, or there's a pending code, or you're not doing it right. So we checked everything else prior to this. So now we're going to do the drive cycle. We checked the temperature, we checked the O2 sensors, we checked pending codes, fuel trim, everything looked good. So we're going to have the student perform a drive cycle. Right now, I wrote the procedure down for him on this piece of paper. Right now, so monitors are running right now. Don't know it. Actually, yeah, you, you see them sitting there, right? The drive cycle started. He ain't just sitting there. The drive cycle is actually started, even though he ain't moving. That's my, that's my clock right there, my human clock. We gotta time each procedure correctly. Yeah, he's just sitting there, but the monitors are running. There are certain monitors running at this time. Even though you just see him sitting there, there are some th there are things happening. The wheels are not moving. He's just sitting there. I think right now, if I remember correctly, I think the O2 heater monitor is running. See, he's about to start the next stage. You see the guy on the right? He's about to tell him his two minutes is up, or three minutes is up. It's time to move on to the next part. Now I just know he wasn't holding the steering wheel. He's supposed to be holding the steering wheel with his seatbelt on, but I missed that. I was too involved and missed it.
you know, every part of the drive cycle has a certain amount of time and the amount of that to run. So the time is part of the new criteria. I'm showing him his next step. Right now, he's going to have to, in about a few minutes, he's going to decel. Now, and they can't touch the brake. You can't touch the brake pedal. So I'm telling them to use the emergency brakes to get it down 20 miles an hour. So you have to go down 20 miles an hour. And I'm telling them to pull an emergency brake and not the foot brake. If you touch the foot brake, you messed up. So I tell them to pull the emergency brake to get to 20. Once you get to 20, release the emergency brake and take back off again. Take off again. See, you hit 20, now you gotta take off again. You see the brake light go back up. Brakes are off, you have to go back up again. I'm, tr I'm going for the scan tool right now. I want to see if the monitor is running to completion. We are almost at the end of the drive cycle, but I want to see if the monitor is actually ran to completion. Now to see this, you go to the readiness test on your scan tool. You can see they all complete except the ones that are not supported. See, but everything else, everything else is complete. So this car is ready to re to re small now, and it should pass now.
Now we're timing every step. Now this car is actually done. It's ready to pass a small check. But I wanted to complete the whole thing before we stop. And you still got a few more minutes left. Even though it's ready to small, I want to do the whole drive cycle just to make sure. Now you see I haven't stopped him with the emergency brake to 20 miles an hour. Once you get to 20 miles an hour, then he can do then he can do the rest. Then you hit the standard brakes. got the picture before, but look at it now. It says it's complete now. Alright. Oh, so I know it was going through a test, huh? Now we're going to smog it.